guess he has Bowser. Nope, I don't think that's Bowser. Oh yeah, that was Bowser. I knew it. I'm smart. My man's invading Russia. Um, okay. That's so cool, I guess. Oh no, he destroyed a building. That's kind of sad, it's I guess. It's a 9-11 joke. OMG. I love Oh bus. man, whoa, whoa, mm -hmm. this actually... Say something, wow. I hear your wait. amazing voice. No, wait, this actually feels like a Mario movie. Open the gates. Oh my, oh my god, Bowser voice actually not bad. Bowser voice actually not bad. And it has enough oh, cartooniness. I wasn't expecting wait, that. Wait, the animation though. I wasn't expecting this appearance. Okay, yeah, but yeah, of course, as you said, that's actually data. a funny joke, haha. -ha. Yeah, don't do much. That is but a taste of our fury. Do you yield? A dragon never no. yields, OMG. <laughs> I do not. But I was kind of OP, not gonna lie. Holy shit, I, it's the star. Shit. Okay, Mario voice time. Mario voice time. Okay, wait, pause. My man is Fix It Felix Jr., bro. My man is Fix It Felix yeah, Jr. Yeah, you're right to say he looks like the Fix It Felix. Okay, you <laughs> can. Say something. <laughs> you know what he said? What is this place? My man was referencing over the hedge. <laughs> Chris Pratt make over the hedge reference. Do not touch that mushroom, you'll die! Oh, I'm sorry. That one's perfectly fine. Come on, Mario! Mushroom Kingdom, here we come! I'm sorry, Chris Pratt, you... You don't, you, you don't make a good Mario voice. Toad was okay. I'm, I'm gonna reverse it back a bit. I wanna hear Chris Pratt's voice. It doesn't sound so bad. I mean, they did say they would remove the Italian stereotype. There's no Italian. Yep. I, I mean, okay. Maybe you get cancelled for making a stereotypical Italian voice. But what is Mario without the stereotypical Italian voice? Uh, Mamma mia! I'm about to steal my girlfriend again. We got to stop it, Toad. No, you say you go. Uh, what is this place? And you go. Oh, what is this place? You know, where did that go? Uh, you... It's not Mario. If he doesn't go, uh, Mamma mia! What is this place? <laughs> you don't even sound like Emmett. You're not even as like enthusiastic. <laughs> Mario. I would think Mario's a very enthusiastic guy. <laughs> But no, it's just kind of shit. Toad's voice. Toad's voice isn't hoarse enough. It isn't bad enough. Like, I, I, it's too high quality. No, like, Toad's voice is just too high quality. Like, Toad's voice is supposed to sound like this. Hello, Mario! And then they gave him an actual quality voice. Oh. Luigi! Luigi actually sounds good. From his grunts, I think Luigi sounds good. And 3, 2, 1. It's up to Disney H now to like see how bad such good this film is. And the answer is everything was good until Chris Pratt came in. Then it was bad. Also, Toad, I don't understand why the Toad sounds so good. It should be poorer quality. He should sound annoying as hell. But he sounds okay here. Not not like not annoying at all, but not annoying enough. To be told so um from what i hear luigi luigi sounds fun and i hope from what i see in the trailer there's a luigi's mention reference somewhere because he you know yeah i just hope uh, bowser seems a lot more evil this time doesn't seem to be kidnapping princess peach yet um however bowser doesn't seem to have a motivation placed out yet so i don't know what's bowser's like mo mo motivations to do what he is doing Mario seems confused and not Italian yet. So hopefully later in the movie he realizes that he's true Italian blood and he starts, you know, making these mamma mia voices. Otherwise, 
Why is he Mario? Why is he Mario? It's not Mario unless he's Tank. <laughs> Alright? So, yeah, that's it. That's all I have to say. Okay, okay. Let me now give my thoughts on it. Man, this actually looks good. It has the right amount of video, game graphics, and the right amount of detail. It's kinda like a Mario game, but the animation for it is much better. Jack Black as Bowser is really good. Toad's voice actor reminds me of the boy from the Captain Underpants movie from DreamWorks. I feel the reason why Toad sounds less annoying is because he is supposed to be in this movie for a long period of time, if he has that obnoxious voice for that long, it may end up, like the Minions or Drew from Despicable M3. My thoughts on it are that it isn't as bad as what Javalia has to say about it and I'll give this trailer, a 7.5 or an 8 out of 10, it's just that good. Um, on scale of 1 to 10, I rate this trailer, um, a big, beastly 7, 6.5 to 7 out of 10. Yeah, it's not like horrible, like, it was pleasant to watch, not the best to hear, especially after Chris Pratt came in. The sound design is good and all. Effects look amazing. Um, it does look... The physics is good. Uh, but um, yeah, we need... They, they kind of spoil like a whole scene already. Um, Mushroom Kingdom looks detailed. But too detailed, if you know what I mean. Like, I like Mushroom Kingdom, but the only reason I like Mushroom Kingdom is because it looks like rubber. The mushrooms are too ultra-realistic. The pipe, I can see the pipe, it's just... That's what I want everything else to look like. Everything else looks broken, like it looks detailed, right? Like there's moss growing, bricks are falling off, um, the mushrooms have like cuts in them. But the pipe is just there with no cuts, no like... What is it called? It, it doesn't look damaged. Like it, you can't tell that this pipe was like... How old it is. It looks like a few days old at most, right? That's how the whole Mushroom Kingdom should look like. And I understand, realistically, the whole Mushroom Kingdom is very old, you know, and fungus grow in a certain way. It's a video game world. There, there doesn't need to be physics, right? There doesn't need to be nature. There doesn't need to be chemistry. It just, just make it fun, right? And if your kingdoms are going to look like all dilapidated and all, the mushrooms aren't going to look fun, then like what's the point of making it a video game movie you know uh, in addition um they really tried to push the physics here like the waterfalls give off rainbows but in the original games it doesn't i get that oh yeah in real life that would happen but you know this isn't real life this is mario also the grass exists which shouldn't because grass should be looking like rubber and flat so yeah that's all i have to say all right peace out I was kinda worried that this movie would be a lot different from the game, but I'm relieved by how well this movie balances the lore from the game and an original story. It's kinda like Sonic the Hedgehog 2 where the two parts are well balanced and evened out. Anyway, I'm pretty hyped for this movie. Thank you all for watching this reaction video by two broke YouTubers and I hope y'all have a nice day. Anyway, since you all stayed here, until the end, here's a short teaser for my upcoming Halloween song as a reward. Please enjoy and thank you everyone for watching.